Hello, welcome back to another comic books buying tip. I shot a video recently about the Ferengi rules of comic book acquisition. And this video, this topic is somewhat related to that video. In that video, in case you've seen it, the rule is don't share with your competition what you're looking for because they might buy a book from under you, okay? And I think some people may misunderstood that rule by, by thinking that, oh, you know, don't share any information with other people because they are your competition. That's not the case, okay? And in this video, hopefully I will differentiate the situation for sure, you can ask, you can go on the CCC forum or on Facebook or on Instagram, or you can even post a comment in a person video. I get this all the time from people that watch my videos. Hey, I'm looking for a copy of this book. Do you have a copy for sales or do you know anybody having a copy for sales, right? Yes, often when you solicit people for, for a copy, for sure, don't expect a great deal, okay? I understand some of us, many of us, don't have a lot of time. And sometimes, even if we do have a lot of time, some of us just can't seem to find the copy that we want. Been there, done that, but I am a, a hunter that enjoy the hardship that come with hunting for a tough book. So I don't mind, it's frustrating, but at the same time, it's a, a fun kind of frustration, if you know what I mean. So I don't mind. I don't mind if the hunt can take me years to find the right copy, not a big deal. This, this hobby has always been a lifelong marathon for me. It's not an instant gratification. I need a copy now. I'm not going to spend any more time looking for it. I got to have it. Some people are like that. Okay, some people are like that. If you are soliciting others to get your copy, regardless if you don't want to put in the work, some people they're too busy with their lives. They, they're, they're hard at work, they have big family, or whatever situation. Some people just are not in the luxury of having a lot of free time like me. I understand that, but whatever that reason is, if you're gonna say, I don't have time to do the work, and then you want to solicit other people to find a copy for you, then guess what? You're gonna have to pay a little bit more than you want to, right? Not to say that the people that have a copy and willingly offer a copy for you to buy is not gonna give you a deal. It can still happen. From time to time in the past, I have given a free copy of a book when somebody was asking for a book to buy. I just happened to have more than my share of extra copies, so I gift a copy. It have happened a few times here and there over the past many years, so it does happen, but often when someone solicit a copy, a huge discount is not in the offering, okay? That's just the way things are. If you can get a big discount from someone that's willing to do that, congratulations. It does happen from time to time, but don't expect it. That's the theme of what I'm trying to put across. So, my best advice for those, my comic buying tip for those that say, you know, I don't have time to find a copy of this book, or I have tried and tried and tried, but can't seem to find a copy that I'm happy with, when you asking, when you go out there and post a question on Facebook or Instagram or anywhere, 
do yourself a favor. Do everybody a favor. Tell people what grade you are looking for and tell people what the price range you are willing to spend. It will save a whole lot of wasted effort by other people that may have a copy. Nobody likes to go through the boxes to find a copy for you and then hear that either the copy is too high of a grade, way out of your budget, or too low of a grade. You don't like low grade books. Do yourself a favor. Do us, all of us, a favor. If you're looking for a copy and post a request out there, list the grade range and the price range. Super, super helpful. And sellers out there, will appreciate you for doing that. It is common sense. In my brain, it says so, but you know how life is. Common sense is not common. So I'm just figure doing this video and mentioning this would be helpful for many people. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.